huh? Thank you! <sighs> hey! Yeah! Flying Nimbus! Hold tight, Gohan, we're coming! Earth's dream team to the rescue! I can see a steel bridge. His tail's probably his weak point. If we can squeeze his tail, he should be vulnerable. That's what happened whenever mine got grabbed. How are we supposed to grab his tail? We're closing in on him. Let's head down and move in for the attack. No! He's using a device that tells him our strengths as well as our location. Okay, I forgot about the this a power level of 710 where the hell kakarot's kid no way damn this thing must be busted what another reading and it's heading straight for me there's one no there's two with power levels 322 and 334 they've come So, what brings you chumps here? Isn't it obvious? I'm here to get my son back! Where is he? You're hiding him somewhere, aren't you? His screaming was giving me a headache, so I locked him up in there. But forget about the rot. Don't tell me you actually think you stand a chance against me. You fool! You're not even fit to call yourself a Saiyan! Prepare to die! Why are we always just floating? Cool, we're just playing on the ground. Like you know, floating. believe it or not, battles aren't just about strength. <laughs> Man, he's fast. Your combined power, you're still pathetic. But considering you weren't smart enough to heed my warning, don't deserve to live. 
can't! You, you gotta be kidding me! You know what? Since you're going to die anyway, I might as well tell you something. The two Saiyans I mentioned earlier, they're even more powerful than me. If you've got a new attack hidden up your sleeve, now's the time to use it, Goku! <laughs> Sorry. I'm fresh out. <laughs> Lucky for you, I actually came up with a new technique while I was training. Really? A plan? Ha! It'd be easier just to lie down and wait for the sweet release of death. I'm just going to need enough time to charge up the proper energy for it. Special beam cannon. <clears throat> going to need you to keep him busy while I deal with this. Got it. I'll do what I can. Hope you're ready for this. Special beam cannon! Huh. You just don't know when to quit. You? Alone? What were you two trying to decide who gets to die first? Win or lose it! Whoa! No way! My power! Rock, paper, scissors! <laughs> 
to the hole. just because you're my little brother. Yes! Yes, that's what I like to hear! It'll all be over soon! <laughs> Don't get comfortable! You're next! Damn, if I try to hit him now, he's just going to dodge it! Just were. <laughs> I, I, I can't. 
believe that Kakarot would just throw away his own life. You idiot. Trust me, Goku won't be dead for very long. What? Didn't you know? This planet is home to the Dragon Balls. They grant wishes. Absolutely any wish imaginable. Even bringing someone back from the dead. Uh, damn it. Well, my comrades will be happy to hear that. <laughs> Everything you just said was transmitted to them on the other side of the universe. Once they've learned that I've died, they will come here. How long until then? When, when will they... When do you think they'll get here? A year. Just one year from now. <laughs> Damn it. One year before even stronger warriors arrive. You two... have no hope of beating them. Enjoy what little time have left. <laughs> I... I see. That's pretty much it. Come on, Goku! Hang in there! It's not like you to give up so easily! Trillin, you know... Dying... is a lot worse than I thought it would be. Uh, yeah, but... Don't you worry! We're gonna bring you back really soon! <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> That's so awkward. He just talks. His mouth's moving. Like he's talking, but nothing's coming out. Goku! What the? He's gone! Interesting. I bet Kami has something to do with this. Eh? Huh? Well, I guess we can put our minds at ease if Kami's involved. You guys need to get the Dragon Balls. Kami doesn't possess the power needed to bring someone back to life. Also, Goku's kid will be coming with me for the time being. Uh, what? Uh, you, you're kidding, right? What are you gonna do with him? With a little training and the right teacher, that kid could be capable of serious power. We're going to need all the power we can get before those two Saiyans show up in a year's time. Me training this little runt is our best shot to stand a chance. Once Goku's revived, tell him he'll get his son back and in better shape than he left him. That's an interesting, uh, tournament. Meanwhile, on a planet far, far from Earth. Raditz! The bastard went and got himself killed! He always was an embarrassment. Still, I must admit, I'm very interested in these Dragon Balls. So they're capable of granting any wish? All right, let's go. We're gonna bring Raditz back from the dead? Don't make me laugh. We have no more use for that dead weight. We could wish for eternal youth, for immortality, 
Can you imagine it? Nothing could possibly stand in our way. Sounds good to me. Count me in! Invigorated by the prospect of attaining immortality with the Dragon Balls, the two Saiyans made their way to Earth. I hope you guys are enjoying it as much as I am right now. It's really, really good. And that is why I brought him here as he is. To be trained further. Therefore, if it is agreeable to you, King Yama, I humbly ask that you allow him to meet with King Kai. Hmm, I see. So you intend to take this heaven-bound soul and subject him to the grueling 625,000 mile long snake way so he can meet King Kai. Indeed. Very well. If you wish to see King Kai, then I suggest you be on your way. However, I should warn you that no one has ever, ever made it successfully, other than myself, of course, in over 100 million years. Must be one heck of a journey. I better get started. By the way, did a guy named Raditz come through here? Yes. We've got him marked down for hell, of course. Did he put up much of a fight? <laughs> he sure did. He definitely didn't go quietly, but I sorted him out. Whoa! You must be one heck of a strong guy! So, you were sent along with him, huh? I am the great King Yemma. I occupy a position above that of the Earth's Guardian. Do you know what that means? That means you're crazy strong, right? You don't seem to understand what I'm saying. Of course I'm strong! But it's not just my strength that serves me in this position. You need brains to do this kind of managerial work. Mana... mana what work? Now then. To help you better understand my work, let's give you a little quiz. Uh, well, I'm actually kind of in a hurry. Well then, if that's going to be your attitude, then I guess you don't need to see King Kai. Oh, what? No way! Okay, okay, I'll take the quiz. Why didn't you say that from the beginning? Anyway, let's begin. I'll let you through if you can answer all of my questions correctly. That's right. He made a mess of enough planets to earn himself a place in hell. In fact, he's one of the biggest pains we've ever had to deal with. Right, next question. Correct, of course I am. I am much more powerful. Isn't that right, Kami? Ah, yes, King Yama. You are more powerful. Right. Next question. That's right. No matter where they're from, all who die come here. Like your brother. He wasn't an earthling. Next question. Not bad. That's correct. Those pesky Dragon Balls are indeed how you do it. I hate those things. It's like my job doesn't even matter. Who created those blasted balls anyway? Care to shed some light on that, Kami? Oh, uh, King Yama, I... <sighs> Whatever. Moving on. Sorry, but that's incorrect. It's a fifth question now. What do you mean? Huh? What? This is the fifth question, right? 
Really? Um, one, two, three. Hmm. D of course it was. I, I was just testing you. And you passed the test. Well, that was the true fifth question. There's that trademark denial of his. Mm, I heard that, Kami. Maybe I'll send you to hell when it's your time. Oh, please forgive me, your highness. Boy, he's got one hell of a sense of hearing. <laughs> Oh my god, that was terrible. Oh, you think you're some sort of funny man. Hmm. That's enough of all this. I will allow you to see King Kai. Wow, really? Thanks a bunch, Mr. Yemma. Don't tell me you've forgotten who you're talking to. No, 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 Mr. I'm King Yemma. I haven't. <laughs> That's more like it. If you're going to see King Kai, then go. Well, this is where we part ways. Good luck, Goku. Thanks. I'm not really sure what to expect, but I'm pumped to meet this King Kai guy. Yeah, we got their souls. Back to Little Gohan's adventures. Time to wake up, kid. You've slept long enough. Huh? Who, who are you? Listen up. Time for a reality check. Your daddy is dead, okay? He sacrificed himself to kill the man who kidnapped you. In case you forgot. W what? M my dad's. <laughs> if his friends are vigilant and able to find the Dragon Balls, they can bring him back. However, we've got other things to deal with. Though we were able to defeat Raditz, it sounds like we've got two of his buddies to worry about a year from now. If that's really the case, your father and I probably aren't going to be enough to take these guys down. We need power. Your power. You're going to have to learn to fight and defend the Earth. Gohan's Crash Course in Survival. You're whining. Once I'm done whipping you into shape, you'll be tough enough for anything. Got it? So, you're gonna train me? Okay, what do I have to do? You have to live out here on your own, without distraction. I'm giving you six months. If you're able to survive for that long, I'll teach you how to fight. See ya. Uh, wait! It's scary out here! Don't leave me! Uh, hello? Somebody there? I'm hungry. Uh, I need food. Child.
little twerp. Didn't go and get himself killed already, did he? If the little brat dies here, then that's all he'd ever amount to. A little brat. <coughs> there, done. Now then, time to check on the... Hopefully throwing him to the wolves toughened him up. Let's check on Gohan. to fight the Saiyans. His latent power is our only shot. <laughs> Fine. Just this once, I'll throw him a bone. Oh, we're gonna go find apples. Looks like there's only apples to eat around here. Just oh, it. well. One's probably not enough. This is all he's getting. Grateful Gohan. Apples! I found apples! He's gonna complain, probably. Yay! Huh? Wow! It's kind of bright! For nighttime, at least! Oh! It's the moon! Whoa! It's so big and round! This is the first time I've seen a full moon! Uh oh. What the? There you go. What? You're kidding me! This is a safe true power. Transform into this thing. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Kids out of his mind. No use trying to reason with him at this point. Spamming this move. She's in the system right now. That's enough, you little brat. Try this. Maybe. Yeah, that's good. There we go. release our true power whenever there's a full moon. Even chumps like you should know that. That's right, the full moon!
Who would have imagined a kid had such a transformation in him? Must be a Saiyan blood. Looks like he needs a full moon and that tail of his to transform. Better get rid of it now. Now that that's taken care of, here's some clothes and a sword. I've got my own training to get to, so you're on your own again. If you can somehow manage to survive the next six months, then you will have earned the honor of being trained by the great Piccolo. You're gonna wish you'd never been born when I'm done with you. Hope you're ready. The cutscenes, those are really good. And I don't know if y'all remember, if y'all remember, but that reminds me of Dragon Ball when Roshi destroyed the moon. Whenever Goku is a giant ape. But yeah, the cutscenes look amazing. I guess we go ahead and end it right there. What I really want? Well, Some of mom's finish. meat dumplings. Alright guys, we're going to finish it right there. I hope you guys enjoyed and we'll see you guys on the next one.